Following yesterday's terrorist attack in New York City, the president, with Rex Tillerson and his defense secretary at his side, James Mattis, saying we have to get tough and do what's right for American citizens. Breaking news from the president just now. He said he wants to start the process of terminating that diversity program, the diversity lottery, as he referred to it. And he tweeted about this this morning, uh, calling it a Chuck Schumer beauty. It's a State Department uh, program, calling it it's not nice, it's not nice, it's not good. We want a merit based program for entering this country, come into this country based on merit, the president says. He wants to get rid of chain migration, and he reiterated that multiple times. He moved on to Democrats, calling them obstructionists. He addressed tax reform, saying we will get beautiful new tax cuts and reforms. Now's the time to redouble our efforts ahead of that cabinet meeting. He also uh, previewed his trip to Asia, he, which begins on Sunday. But we're going to open it up to the couch with this because, Judge, he ended by taking a couple questions. He said it, he was asked, is the suspect going to Gitmo? He responded, I'll consider it. He also said what we need is justice and we need strong justice. What we have right now is a joke, said the president. I, I profoundly disagree with him that what we have right now is a joke. The Joint Terrorism Task Force, which is operated out of lower Manhattan, prosecutes terror suspects in federal courts in Manhattan. They have never lost a case. Many of the defendants have been sentenced to, to federal prison for the rest of their, li uh, their lives. They are superb uh, prosecutors. They do provide swift, certain, and fair justice. Now, about Gitmo, this person, as horrific as he is, is a lawful American resident. He has the same rights except for voting and running for office as the rest of us. There is simply no provision for terminating his constitutional rights mm. by putting him in the hands of the military and taking is him to Gitmo. Is that okay with you? I mean, obviously you're going to tell me. I, I think it, it is not okay with me and it's not okay with the Constitution for the president or somebody in government to decide mm. you don't have constitutional rights for sending you uh, to Gitmo. He's horrible what he did. He killed innocent human beings. He will face justice. Look, if he's tried in the state courts here in New York, he cannot be exposed to the death penalty. If he's tried by the Joint Terrorism Task Force in Lower Manhattan for committing acts of terror in the United States of America, he is exposed to the death penalty. He probably will be convicted and he can be executed. That would be fair, lawful, and constitutional. But if they send him to Cuba, it will be unfair, unlawful, right. and unconstitutional.